Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my cooking videos. Uh, today we're going to do a honey mustard chicken uh, in a cast iron skillet. It's really, really delicious. I'm going to show you what you're going to need for your ingredients, um, but you're going to have to prep some stuff first as well. Okay guys, so basically uh, you're going to need about um, four pieces of boneless skinless thigh, some sour cream, honey, some Dijon mustard, some whole seed mustard, olive oil, Monterey Jack shredded, cheddar cheese shredded, some onions, some scallops, and tater tots. And we're going to mix all this together and do a yummy meal. So keep watching. Okay, so uh, we got the four pieces of chicken in here, and we're going to do the, uh, hun the mustard seed. And that's about one tablespoon in there. And then we're going to take some salt and pepper. And we're just going to shake it all over. And then on one tablespoon of olive oil. Okay, now we got all the ingredients in there, so we're just going to take our hands and we're just going to go ahead and mix it all up in there. So while the chicken was getting prepared, we were already cooking the tater tots. This is two pounds of tater tots, which is one bag that you already saw. You only cook it for 20 minutes, not the 28 minutes like it says on the bag, okay? So you take that out, and then what we're going to do is we're going to start cooking the chicken. Okay, and then we're going to high heat. And you just keep searing it, cooking it until the middle is no longer pink. So about four minutes on each side. Okay, and then we're going to flip on about four minutes on this side now. Okay, then we're going to take the chicken out. And what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and cut them into cubes. Okay, and then you're going to dump the onions in the pink skillet where you're going to have the chicken and just kind of caramelize the onions, okay? And when these are done, just put them in a, in a separate bowl. One quick thing I want to point out, go ahead and clean your skillet from all the fat and then you're going to put the tater tots in next. Okay, and in a separate bowl, what you want to do is you want to do the um, honey mustard sauce. So you're going to do two tablespoons of honey. I'm a little bit liberal with the honey. So I'm going to put some honey in there. Okay, and then we're going to do a tablespoon of the mustard seed. Okay. And then we're going to do one tablespoon of olive oil. And then after that, one tablespoon of mustard, Dijon mustard. And then what I like to do is I like to grab a fork and then I just mix everything in there like that. And you kind of whisk it really fast. Okay. And then we're going to take our tater tots. We're going to put it all in the skillet. Okay. You just kind of want to make sure it's all nice and covered. And then we're going to take our chicken. And we're going to put our chicken in there. Okay. 
Okay, and then we're going to take that honey mustard mix that we did, and we're just going to start spreading it all over just like that. Doesn't look like a lot, but you know what? It actually covers everything on there, so don't go around making extra bags of honey mustard. Alright, and then we're going to take our onions that we caramelized and we're going to put onions all over it. Now remember that cheddar cheese that we had? The cheddar cheese and the Monterey Jack? That's right folks, that's going to be next on this. So let me go grab that. Our cheddar cheese, we're going to go ahead and just throw that there. It's just one pound of cheddar cheese that we're doing on here. Okay. And then next, Monterey Jack. Alright, and what you're going to do is you're going to broil this. You're going to put it in the broiler for about 5 to 10 minutes. Okay, and here we go. Right into the middle rack. Looks like this is done. And then what we're going to do is we're going to Put some tomatoes. And we're going to get some scallops. I'd like to add avocado, but didn't have any fresh avocado at the store. Or at least any ripe ones. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. This is really great. Hey, I got this off the internet. It's not my original recipe, but I wanted to try it out so you guys can see how just a simpleton like me can make a really great dish. All right, thank you and enjoy your meal.